Sunday and it's about half past four p.m. Uh, I haven't filmed anything today. Uh, I've been at home doing loads of uh, stuff, editing and writing and housework and boring stuff. Uh, but we're just going to go shopping for grocery stuff, Yay, uh, which grocery is boring. Shopping. But oh, I forgot on the list. Yeah, so I forgot the shopping list, which is great. Um, yeah, we're going to go to Aldi maybe uh, and see if we can get stuff from there. Uh, then we're going to go cook and watch some TV. I don't know what we're doing tonight. Uh, it's very autumny and cold today. Yeah. So I've got my Friday the 13th shirt on, which you can't really see. You'll be anyway. sure when you get out. Lots of leaves on the ground. So I'm back home. Um, yeah, we've been shopping, we've got a few bits. It was kind of annoying actually because um, we didn't have half the things we wanted. So because of the diet plan that we're on, um, we have to have like specific things. So it's really difficult to substitute. So we, well Christopher made a meal plan while I was at work today. Um, and then we went and they didn't have some of the things for the meals that we were gonna do. So yeah, that was a bit irritating. But we did get a few little bits to try, um, some different things. Uh, let me see if I can find them. So, we very rarely have snacks, but um, these are baked black bean snacks. So, they are lower, um, like, carbohydrates, lower carbs than um, some of the other kind of crispy things, and it's got low, low sugar. So there's only 9 carbs per serving and 0.7 sugar, so that's good. And these are katsu curry flavoured, like little beanie things. And we also got some biltong, which is basically like um, jerky. But it's like stuff we can have because it's got hardly any sugar in it. So yeah, so now we've done that, we're just going to unpack the bag, which is my least favourite bit of shopping. Um, yeah, and then we're going to make tea, aren't we? We are. Yeah. Hey, so we've just had um, our tea. We had chicken with hoisin and salad and stuff, uh, which was nice. And now we've just washed the pots and we're going to watch some TV a little bit. Maybe have a coffee. And yeah, uh, I've cleaned everywhere today and cleaned the floors, which hurts my back like crazy but I've cleaned the uh, all of the downstairs and um, polished the wood and stuff that sounded sounded crude um, yeah and that's about it so we'll go see what Victoria's doing in the kitchen shall we yay so just made your coffee you did thank you yes so now we're gonna sit and watch Strictly Come Dancing, it takes two. Yeah. It's our nightly thing we watch while uh, Strictly's on. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what we're doing for the rest of the night. I'll have to make dinner for tomorrow. Yeah. <sighs> I'll make doing. some porridge for in the morning. Yeah, but I hate, it's better doing it in the evening than in the morning. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what else we're doing tonight. No, we might maybe watch a movie or some TV or something. This? Oh no, show it. I've been Christmassy. You've been Christmassy? Yeah. It's bad because it's like the beginning of October. Well, I don't, the end of October. This was from... B&M? B&M or Home Bargains? I don't know. B&M. From B&M. It was two ninety nine, I want to say. Yeah. And you've been wanting an adult Christmas colouring book for I when we get into the... I uh... show. Alright, well, we'll do that in a minute. What have you got? Yeah, I've just shown it, but it's like really cute. It's got... Like, I think it's got some pretty decent pictures in it. Yeah. Oh, that's so, cute. And I like a... Reindeer? Yeah, reindeers. And Santa with a little elf. Santa's wearing bear slippers. Yeah. Smoking a corncob pipe. And... What else? Oh. Angels. Angels. And oh, I like the snow globe, snowmen. that's cool. <coughs> yeah, this will be really fun, although I don't know what you're going to colour the snowmen in as, unless you make them, them blue. Leave yeah. That's cute as well. Yeah, they look really nice. Are you happy with your, your uh, 
Christmassy colouring book. Yeah. I so, actually uh, broke today and listened to Christmas music at work. Well, it's nearly November and we start our Christmas planning and Chris well we've already bought most of our Christmas yeah, gifts. Yeah, we've pretty much finished for Christmas. Uh, we just need each other really uh, yeah. and a couple of bits. So yeah, we probably start right early in November. Are we doing Vlogmas again? We I think might. So. I've just we might do. My it. Finger. Oh. So we opened up the uh, black bean chip things and this is and we've just got a really small little bowl with them in. And we've got I don't know if you can see it. Uh, yeah, Eleanor dreaming, you know, Luke and Rich, and we're just watching their current September 2018 vlogs, so we're getting very excited about our trip, even though it's over 365 days away, which is just so long, but yeah, we enjoy watching the Florida vlogs, and this is the one we're watching tonight. Morning, it's Tuesday morning, uh, it's about... Well, it's quarter past six. Uh, we're both tired. We stayed up last night and we watched uh, Making a Murderer Season 2. So we're watching that until about half past eleven and then we went to bed. Um, yeah, it's a really good show. It's very frustrating and twisty and turny. Um, we like true crime, so it's good. Uh, Victoria's just having her porridge in the morning covered up because it's a bit nippy. And also I don't want to spill it on my top. No. <laughs> Oh, we've got porridge, mine's just in the uh, kitchen cooking, um, so I'm going to go get mine. Yeah, I've got a coffee and some porridge. Hey, so it's now, what time is it? <clears throat> I should really plan. It's nine, I've just been doing a lot of writing, uh, doing a lot of freelance stuff at the minute, so I've... Been spending the last three hours doing that. I'm wearing a glove because my hand's really cold. My fingers are still cold. wonder why. Uh, I've just been watching this, which I've just put on pause. It's towards the end. It's the Horror Hangout. Uh, I've been, I watch these back because I don't stay up to watch them. Uh, it's a bunch of uh, horror community guys here on YouTube. Um, I think I'm sub to most of these people. Um, I just love them. I, I, I just love these hangouts. And this is the last one that uh, my friend Lisa, that Lisa Loves, is doing. So I want to watch it. Um, I'll try and leave a comment um, in a minute. But yeah, I don't know. Kind of get the urge to jump more into the horror community. But with this being joint channel and Victoria's not a horror fan, it's not really something that I can do. Like full on. But I watch a lot of horror stuff, especially in the last few months. So uh, I've been enjoying that uh, while I've been writing. And... Um, yeah, head to uh, my blog, thecinephiliacs.wordpress.com. I'll leave it here. Uh, for exclusive reviews and articles, we've got some interviews up. I'm, I've got some lined up with uh, film directors and actors and stuff. I've, I've interviewed various people in the past, directors, actors, writers, authors, all sorts of stuff. Uh, I've just put an article up about pro wrestling and movies and how wrestlers appear in movies and uh, all that sort of stuff. Um, I've been emailing with people about an opportunity that's arose to do with freelancing, which should be really cool. And that's it, really. I mean, it's been quite a quiet morning. But I am going to take a movie break and watch Halloween 2 because we are going to see the new Halloween tonight. All going well, and I'm excited about it. I'm excited to watch it. Most most everybody else I know that wanted to see it has already seen it, so I'm probably the last one. So nobody cares now, but it's only been out a few days, and I'm excited to watch it. I want to leave it till a bit closer to Halloween. And also, um, the evenings like when it came out, we didn't have free, so we couldn't really go. So I'm excited to watch it. Uh, we watched Halloween together at the weekend, the original, 78 one, and uh, it had been a few years since I watched it, and I love it. Victoria enjoyed it, so we should be fine. It should be good. Um, but I just thought I'd check in and say hi, and now I'll go, because I have nothing else to say. Okay, folks, Halloween 2 is in. And I'm about to watch it, so uh, I'll let you know how I th what I think of it afterwards. Um, yeah. Hey, so um, yeah, I'm just gonna go cook. I've got my uh, the MacBook. 
and I'm going to uh, listen to the Something A Wrestle podcast and um, do some cooking. I'm going to cook tonight's dinner, um, which I'm doing some sort of like Indian chickpea sort of dal, but with uh, mixed greens and stuff stirred in. So it's a vegetarian meal, but uh, it sounds really good. So I'm going to cook this so it's ready to heat up when we get in. Tonight after seeing Halloween. I've just finished Halloween 2. Uh, I uh, really enjoyed it. I um, haven't seen Halloween 2 in years. The DVD copy is pretty poor. I would like a Blu-ray eventually. But I enjoy the movie. I mean, it's far-fetched and all that stuff, but it's horror. It happens. Um, I think it's very enjoyable and a nice continuation from the first one. Uh, I'm looking forward to carrying on watching them. I'll probably, after seeing tonight, going to see the new Halloween, I'll probably carry on all the way through the series uh, if I can. So yeah, I'll show you a little bit of what I'm cooking as I do it. And um, yeah. Okay, so we've got some black eyed be beans, chickpeas, you can use lentils instead of these, but I uh, couldn't find lentils yesterday at the market. Some mixed herbs, some whole grain mustard, but again, you can also use mustard seeds, some medium curry powder, and then this is basically just some uh, green tender heart cabbage or you can use spring greens or green cabbage whatever you like uh, I'll show you this when it's cooking uh, I'm just going to rinse off uh, the beans in a colander I'll just put them in here and I'm just rinsing off the brine and then I can leave them to dry uh, while I prepare the rest of this stuff I'm also going to chop some onions and fry some onions off to begin with you can add any sort of vegetables you want really um, but yeah, let's carry on cooking. got back from Halloween, the new Halloween movie at the cinema and it was really good, I liked it um, quite a bit, really good. Uh, yeah, we've just come home and we're just about to have the food that I started cooking earlier on. Hey, it's the first time I've been on camera today. So um, yeah, I'm not the biggest horror movie fan, but I am. Um, I actually didn't mind that. Um, there wasn't too many jump scares, which are the things that I really don't like. Yeah, I enjoyed it. It wouldn't be one that I would like rush out to see again. Uh, but if Christopher's watching it, I'd probably sit and watch it with him. Because, yeah, it was alright. So I'm looking forward to tea. I wish you could smell it. It smells so good. Um, I don't even know what it is. Christopher's decided what it is. But it looks like it's some sort of chickpea thing with... Um, I don't know if you can see it. Is it steaming up? Oh yeah. So yeah, it's like chickpea with cabbage and it's, it smells like Indian spices, but yeah, it smells really good. So I'm really looking forward to this because I'm really hungry as well. So yeah, I'll catch you up in a bit. It's Bake Off time! I'm very excited about this. Uh, it's the semi-final this week and yeah, we always watch this on a Tuesday when it's on and complain about the fact we can't eat any of the things that they're showing. So yeah, we're going to go watch this and enjoy it. So it's not that late compared to normal. It's like 5 to 10. Yeah, so we kind of tired. Yeah, we finished watching Bake Off. We've cooked breakfast, apples for the morning. Um, and yeah, we're going to go to bed. Yeah. Because it's been a, a tiring day. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, we'll see you in the morning. Bye. Bye. Hey guys, it is uh, Wednesday and it's about quarter to four, four o'clock in the afternoon. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so Victoria's on her way home and then we're going to go out, get, uh, go to the post office because I've got a parcel of some, I don't know, a mystery package to pick up. Um, yeah, I've watched Halloween 3 and 4 today while I was doing some writing and some freelance stuff. Really enjoyed them. Uh, number four more than number three actually, which I didn't expect. So I watched those and um, yeah, not much else. I've got my cool touch shirt on that I had on yesterday because it's awesome. And I brought my uh, box set of Friday, uh, Friday the 13th, Nightmare on Elm Street down because I've been in the mood 
to revisit this. Uh, I can't remember with a lot of the horror series which of the series I've seen and haven't seen. I know I've seen like the first three Nightmare on Elm Street and I know I've seen New Nightmare and Freddy's Dead I think. I might have seen all of them but I can't remember. I think I've seen them the fourth. I'm sure I've seen I'm sure I've seen them all but anyway I'm excited to watch them. Uh, apart from that it's just been right in and uh, not much else today at the moment. So we're going to go out and then come back, cook, and watch some TV and have a peaceful evening. It's cold today, so I've got the hat on. Um, yeah, so I just thought I'd check in and say hello Wednesday. Hey, I am back from work. Um, we've just been to the post office and picked up a package. We have no idea what's in it. Do you know what's in it? No idea. So we don't know what's in it, and then we just stopped and bought a few bits for tea because we didn't want the thing that we'd planned to have. So we're gonna have like a scramble with just like egg and some low fat sausages and some, well sorry, low carb, like high meat sausages. Um, and some, what else? Peppers, Peppers and, and onions and mushrooms. And then because we fancied it, a little bit of black pudding on the side. Yay. Yeah. Hello, it's later on now. Um, we've got caught up watching Making a Murderer. Um, series 2, so we're really enjoying that, just making a drink and Christopher's got an ulcer so he's just having a salt mouthwash just to see if that helps it a little bit um, yeah so I don't know what time it is, can you see on the clock? oh 20 to 10 it's 20 to 10 yeah so we haven't really done much this evening uh, I think we've both just been a little bit tired, we started watching Making a Murderer yesterday and yeah it's so good we both really really like crime shows and this is true crime and it's just kind of mental um what happened and i'm just really kind of need to know where it goes and what actually happens so yeah i think we're gonna watch another couple of episodes before we go to bed maybe but yeah it's not really been an exciting day in terms of vlogging because we haven't actually done that much so Hopefully the next couple of days will be more exciting because it's our wedding anniversary on Friday and we're going out for a meal over the weekend so yeah and I'm also in my because I'm really cold tonight my little poo like robey thing kind of like a dressing gown but it's not really a dressing gown it's more like a cape and then I got from Primark last year and it's very warm and snuggly so yeah have you got anything to say? No not really I don't know anything Okay, so we'll probably maybe check in before bed. If not, then we'll see you tomorrow. Hey, so we're just going to go to bed now. It is quarter to midnight because we watched an extra episode of Making a Murderer. It's like so intense and addictive and I need to know what happens. It's an unbelievable show. If you've not seen it, it's been well documented. Everyone's heard of it, but definitely watch it. There's some amazing documentary series on Netflix and I think this is the best one um, of the ones I've watched. So yeah. Can't wait to keep watching it tomorrow evening. And we'll say good night now. Night! Hey guys, it is Thursday already, finally. It took a while, I don't know. I don't know whether this week's going slow or fast. Anyway, um, it is about 4.30 and I were about to go when Victoria gets outside. I'm going to run outside, get in the car and go and get our flu jabs. Um, because it's that time of year. I'll take them off because you can't see my eyes. Uh, it's that time of year, so we're going to go get the flu jabs. And then I think we might go out for food. I think we might go to a curry house or something. There's a nice curry place near us. Uh, that do like a midweek sort of early bird sort of menu. Where you get like three courses for £10 or something really good. So we might go to eat tonight. Instead of tomorrow, which is our anniversary. And then we might have a night in tomorrow and just hang out. Uh, I'll cook something probably. Uh, yeah, so we might do that. I'm, I've am i watched quite a lot today. I've been doing my writing. I got a lot of work and writing done like early. So I've had a lot of the day f just to watch movies, which is good. So I watched Halloween 5, which was terrible. Uh, I'd never seen it before, so it was a first time watch for me. And it was, oh man. I mean, if you've seen it, you know. I imagine there's fans out there that maybe find it endearing or funny I uh, might need to see it again before I get there I didn't enjoy it uh, I'm now on number six which I am enjoying more so far but I am only half an hour in 
but it's kind of a short one. It's only 85 minutes, so... But I'm enjoying it so far. There's been a couple of good kills. The acting's better. And it's very 90s, which uh, is kind of weird because it's the first time Halloween's in the 90s. So, yeah, it feels weird at the minute. So, yeah, uh, I will watch a bit more of this and then I'll finish it off tomorrow and then probably carry on. Watch H2O um, and Resurrection and maybe the Rob Zombie ones. I'll see how I feel as to whether I actually watch them or not. I might. I probably will. Uh, and then Nightmare on Elm Street. So I'm excited. I'm really enjoying watching them. Even though I didn't like five, I have enjoyed something about all of the others that I've watched so far. And I really enjoy, I love the first one. I really liked the new one. I enjoy the second one. I really enjoyed the fourth one. Third one I'm a bit iffy about. I've kind of found it boring. I don't know if I've said that. Um, but anyway, I'm rambling about Halloween. I'll, I'll talk to you when we get back from our meal, unless we film it but I can't see it because it's a kind of a small, little, tiny, intimate restaurant. And I'm pretty sure the waiters would be looking at me weird if I started whipping this out and filming my food. So we will see anyway. Hello. Hello. It's the first time I've been on today. Yeah, I checked in before we went out. Yeah, we forgot to take the camera with us. Oh, I said I probably wouldn't anyway. Oh. We went for a curry after we went for our flu jabs. Yeah. At the doctor's. So what did you have to eat? I, well, we both had poppadoms with dips to start. Yes, and then we had chicken pakoras, which yeah. were very tasty. Tasty. And then I had a chicken korma, because it was just from like a set menu. Yeah, so they were mostly traditional like curries. Yeah. I had, what did I have? A dupe dansak. dansak. I think so. It was like a mild pineapple-y one, which I don't normally have, but I didn't want anything spicy tonight. You didn't want tomato-based either. No. So it was really tasty though. We enjoyed it. Um, we it was actually the first carbs we've had in a long while. Yeah, it was. So we had a bit of rice with it. So. I'm super full. I like I'm very like full. Podged. Yeah, I'm full. But I'm going to have a drink and sit and watch the Mayhem Classic. Yes. So that should be fun. And you're snuggled up in your uh, Winnie the Pooh yeah. um, thing. Because I'm so cold. It's chilly. <laughs> yeah. And I'm just, uh, yeah, just in, in my like usual, like, lounging top. Yeah, so uh, I don't know if we'll be on again. We might talk about the main classic if we remember. If not, and it will be tomorrow, but uh, tomorrow's our anniversary. It is, yay. Back home, yay. <laughs> I it's only early. did half a day today, yeah. so that's good. And now we're just gonna open our anniversary cards. Anniversary cards. It's our third wedding anniversary. Yep, third year, married and 17 and a half years together so we're gonna open these and then maybe go out and get a coffee in a cafe and have yeah, a wander around just have or something. Have a look around. Um, yeah. So yeah. we'll probably show you what we got in a minute. Yay. Hello. So we've opened our cards, it was very nice. We got some, we got some cards. nice cards so thank you to people that sent us the cards. Um, and we gave each other a couple of prezzies. Do you want to show what you got? Yeah, we just got a little bit of stuff just because I think we're going to put some money in our Florida fund again. Well, we already did as well, didn't we? We put 50 in. Yeah, but... We might put some more in the end of the month. Yeah, so I got the little um, gold edition Mickey from October. Yeah, it's so cute. Into the little one. Um, I got these, which are so cute. I need way more now because they're just... They are very cute. It's a good deal as well. Yeah, so these are the tiny big feet. From Disney. So got a little stitch one. It's very cute. Aww. We got these because they don't match up with anything, so like they're just random ones. Yeah. A little silly. It's so cute. They don't have a mic yet. No, it's got like a little tail and it's cute cool. little horns. It's cute. And then this one's so adorable. It is the cutest one. Little Dumbo. Aww. Dumbo. Look at his nose. Or his trunk, I should say. It's a trunk, yeah. <laughs> He's very cute, and his little big ears, and his little hat on. So, I got them, and then I also got... Yeah. This Beauty and the Beast. Like, it looks like a video if I just do it like that, but... It's yeah, one of the notebooks. it's the VHS style. Open the front cover. It's difficult because you're leaning on my arm, but... Yeah, there it is. And I just, I love it. these, it's so cool. So, yeah. Yep. I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but... You can never have too many notebooks. Yeah, we're, we're notebook people. Uh, and then you got me a couple of movies. I did. 
So I got Night of the Creeps, the Blu-ray. Um, it's got loads of features on it. I love it, and it's. I don't think it's ever been out on Blu-ray in the UK, and I've never owned any sort of copy of it. I watched. We watched it when we used to be able to watch the US Netflix. So I'm excited to watch it again. And then he got me the Troll Complete Collection Blu-ray set, which has Troll One and Two and the documentary Best Worst Movie, which I really like. So I'm also excited about that because it's corny and funny. Um, so thank you, I like both of them. And uh, oh, my arms get tired. <laughs> well, we so yeah, we're gonna go out, room. aren't we now? Yes, I don't know where we're going yet. We've not decided, and we're very indecisive. Yeah, I so, want a drink that I've been saving myself. Yeah, and I want to go and have a look at boots. Oh. So somewhere with the boots and somewhere with somewhere for a drink. Boots is a pharmacy slash cosmetics cosmetics and like gift shop. No, it doesn't mean you want to go look at shoe boots. No, boots, there's a store. in here, isn't there? I know. Hello. I like that up there. You are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think, is it? Yeah, it's cute. I like the dumbbell cup as well. It's very cute. Yeah. Got some really nice stuff. They have. So we're back from shopping, um, it's like five to four now. So we went, where did we go? We went just around a couple of shops near us. We did a tiny little bit of filming. Mm. But it was really busy for a Friday afternoon, it was crazy. And then went to Tesco and bought, I didn't know this was there, but some Halo Top Mint Chop Chip, £1.38, normally a fiver. Yeah. So we got two. We did to have, but random times. Yeah, because sometimes it's just nice to have um, something sweet. Yeah. This is like one of the things we can have. I can't get it in the freezer, so you'll have to do it. Okay. Hey, so it is now half past eight and we're in comfy clothes. It's cold, so I've got a bathrobe thing on. And we are just gonna grab a little bit of food. We're not that hungry, actually. Uh, we had lunch a bit later, so we're not really hungry. We might grab a cheese string and a drink. And then we're just gonna sit and watch Probably the rest of making a murderer tonight, or as much of it as we can get done. I think we can get it finished. Yeah. Um, tomorrow morning, hello. Hey. Um, my parents are coming because they've been away to Greece for a couple of weeks, so we haven't seen them in like three weeks or something. So they're visiting us. Um, and yeah, I think we might go out with them for a bit. And uh, yeah, but I've got something to show you actually and a thank you to make, so give me a second. Yeah, so we got home like late afternoon. And we had a card in the post from our friend Lisa and Darren and Isaac over at Lisa Loves. And they were kind enough to send us an anniversary card and it was really, really nice. It was really nice. Of it was them. a really nice surprise. So thanks so much, guys. Honestly, it's really yeah, thank kind. Thank you. And we're going to go put it up in a second, but I wanted to show it. It's super cute. So thank you so much. Um, anything else? Nothing else. I think we've just got a quiet evening planned. A quiet anniversary evening. Yeah, because we went out for a meal yesterday. Yeah. I'm going out for a meal on Sunday. Yeah. So we just thought we'd have a relaxy day. Yeah, so we're going to go chill out and then we'll probably see you in the morning. Yeah, we'll, we'll see you in the morning. Yeah. Hi. Good afternoon. It's uh, Saturday at about four o'clock. Um, yeah, we've not done any filming uh, so far today. Christmas mum and dad came this morning and yeah we just went into a local town got a few bits do you want to show people what we got yeah okay um i'm gonna shut you off for a sec i'll go and get the things we got hello yeah so i'm gonna show you what we got is that right yeah well yeah you might as well. i got this hoodie that i'm wearing now so it's like a green it's comfy it's i don't know if it's picking up that it's green it looks kind of brown 
Yeah, it's like a foresty green colour. So that's, it's nice. Eight pounds at Primark. It's comfy. So, and I'm, I've been really cold today. It's been freezing. It's like four degrees. Yeah, this morning, uh, friends over at AIM Publicity, A-I-M Publicity, the link will be below, sent me the change link. I'm so excited about this. They sent me Amateurville and uh, Extra the other day, and now this. Uh, it's the second site release, and I just wanted to make mention of it because I love the change link. I watched this when I was younger and it frightened me. I've seen it a couple of times since. It's a George C. Scott Haunted House movie, and it's amazing, and it's just got this cool new release, so... Yeah, and then we went to, we got normal stuff like tissues and ibuprofen. They don't count as things to buy though. No, uh, when we were in Primark, a new range by someone called Saffron Barker. Um, and there's these bottles which are like the, what are they called? Vacuum insulated bottles and you can, they keep hot drinks hot for 12 hours and cold drinks properly cold for 24 hours apparently. It's got a really cool design on it. Uh, and these sort of bottles can cost up to like 30 quid. We've yeah, seen we Disney saw some in Typo like Disney ones and they were 30 quid. Um, and this was seven from Primark, so it's definitely. They've got some cool stuff in that range, like there's a cool cushion and mug and stuff. I have no idea who she is. No, I'll have to look. But, uh, and then we nipped into a charity shop. This is from the Oxfam charity shop and it is a American edition release from Titan Books of New Fears 2. Uh, I haven't got New Fears 1, but it's basically just a horror collection of short stories from different authors. And I do like short stories, and these seem very short. Some of them are like, well, that specific one's are 20 pages or something, but some are like four or five pages, and I do like when there's a big mix, because you can actually do some pretty creepy things in even just a paragraph. So I'm excited about that. I like when there's a load all in one anthology. So that was actually one ninety nine, which I don't usually pay for a second hand book, but it's doesn't look red. Yeah, and it's one And it's one that I will read. I might even read that now. That might be my current book. Uh, and then, my mum spotted, because with mum and my dad this morning, they've gone home now, but we saw them and we walked around town with them. And we nip in charity shops now and again to see if there's any books or movies or anything. And my mum spotted this on the wall. And it's you can a, just see Actually, it smells really nice. It smells really new. And it's from the Disney store. Disney store authentic. So we, you know, we like to pick up the official stuff that's in nice condition, looks really clean, smells good, no marks on him at all. His hair's even it's a little goofy. So it looks really new. I don't know when he was released, but they do have goofies just like this now in the Disney yeah. store. It's the same size as the Donald we've got, mm -hmm. and the Mickey and Minnie. So we didn't have a goofy. One pound forty nine. Yeah, so, really good value. Really good. I think that's it. We've got tissues and ibuprofen, like you said, but they don't count as things. So, and now we're going to go pick up some washing because we took it to the laundrette because we can't dry our clothes in this weather. And it's really cold now, isn't it? It's it's really cold. Yeah, so we're going to go do that and then go home and just, I don't know, come home. I want to try and find a new top, maybe. Yeah, we might go look for a I'm not sure, though. top or something, but... Yeah. yeah, we'll catch you in a bit. See you in a bit. So we're back, we've got our washing, and hello. Sorry, I was yawning. It's okay, do you want to show the things that I got? Yeah, we've... Um, I found them today. Found we them don't today. have snacks very often, but because it's uh, anniversary weekend, we allowed ourselves a treat. I saw these from Asda, and it is, what are they? Cheese and onion chickpeas. Yeah, so they're actually low carb, and the carb in a chickpea isn't as bad as a carb in, like, say, a potato. Salt and vinegar ones. So I'm going to give you low sugar and fairly low calorie, like they're not that bad. No, they're all right. Iron fibre, chickpeas are nice, so we're going to see what these are like. They're a pound each. Yeah. We thought we might just spread a little bit of a nibble. Nibble. Yeah. So what are we doing now? Um, Strictly's on soon, so we might cook tea. Okay. And then, watch Strictly. Yeah. It's Halloween. Yay, Halloween. I was going to show Halloween stuff, but you can't really see it. We've got all of our underwear, just up. Well, mm -hmm. some of them anyway. Yeah, these are our uh, Ooh, we should show this. anniversary cards that we got. What your mum and dad brought us this morning. Oh, let's show that. Yeah, so your mum and dad um, just got back from Greece. Yeah. And um, when we went to Greece, which you can see... Um, we have we a did, blog up, yeah. yeah. We'll link it below if I remember. We bought 
some of these little houses. Yeah. So we showed them on a Greek Greece vlog uh, haul, I think. Yeah. So they very kindly bought us a third one. This one with a different shaped roof. Now we don't have the others out at the moment because we've got our autumn stuff out, but yeah, it's so there cute. There it is. It's like We've got different roofs. We've got like a sharp roof and a point, uh, different sort of like. Yeah, like a normal style house roof. Yeah. Then this a like flat roof we've got as well. Circular we? roof. And then a circular one. So different roofs and they all kind of going to match. Got a door and windows, hand painted and. And we just really like these. Yeah, they're really pretty. I don't pretty. know whether they're for tea lights. Yeah, I think you can put tea lights in. We don't necessarily do that, but. No, but yeah. Really cute. It's really cute. So and thank you, mum and dad. It says on the bottom, handmade. Yep, thank you mum and dad for the lovely present. Yeah. And yeah, let's go and cook and get into some comfy clothes. What are you doing? I'm just slicing the steak. For with uh, our dinner. So we're having, I'm gonna cut the steak into strips and I'm gonna put some spices on it, some like taco seasoning spice with some peppers and some mushrooms and I'm gonna do lettuce wraps and we've got some refried beans. Uh, did I say mushrooms, onions, things like that? Yeah. Uh, we've got some guac. Some guacamole and some sour cream, so it should be like a variation of a kind of Mexican meal. So. With some steak, this is just rump steak. So, yeah. so. trying to cut it finely enough so you... We get quite a bit of it. So you get more pieces. Yeah, so I'll show you when it's cooking. Hey guys, so we're just about to go up to bed now. It's about 1.30 in the morning. We've been watching some YouTube, um, watching some like videos for the hype and interviews for Evolution, which is the first all-women's wrestling pay-per-view um, tomorrow night, so we're going to watch that, that should be fun. So we've been watching a few videos about that and just regular youtube -y Disney stuff. And now we're going to go up to bed and see you in the morning. We've got a nice meal out for our anniversary meal tomorrow, so that should be nice, and we'll uh, catch you then. So, night. Morning! It is Sunday, which is the last day of this weekly vlog. Um, yeah, we're just about to go out. We've got our uh, stuff on. We're about to go for our anniversary meal um, in a nice restaurant in Manchester. We'll try and film a little bit. So we've had a quiet morning. It's like about, what time is it now? Like Half ten. Half ten? It's still early. So it's quite early. We've been up since like eight o'clock. The clocks went back, so we've got an extra hour. Um, so yeah, we've got ready. I've got a new Tweedy jacket on and a black Marks and Spencer's shirt. It's hard to show you, but... Yeah, and then, um, yeah, we're gonna go now. We're gonna give ourselves plenty of time. We don't have a reservation till 12. It takes about 40 to 45 minutes to get there, but it's a really nice country drive. So, it, just in case of traffic, we're going a bit earlier. And then... We can always sit and have a drink before our reservation, unless they don't open, in which case we'll sit in the car park and wait. So, uh, we'll talk to Victoria for a minute. Hello. Morning. Morning. So, I've been very productive this morning. I've had a shower, dried my hair, um, ironed our clothes. Yep, did that. Yeah. So now we're just about to get ready. We're going to stop off at Asda first because um, we need a few bits for tonight. Um, and I don't want to leave it until like after. No. The meal in case it's short because it's Sunday, so it shuts at four. Yeah. Um, yeah. So we want to get some because it's wrestling tonight. So we're yeah. gonna get sort of a couple of like spring watery drinks maybe and things because we haven't got a lot in. We haven't and those chickpea things we yeah, should get quite nice. are really nice. And we've they're not something we'll snack. normally get, but as soon as we're having a couple of treats this weekend, that's quite a good snack. Yeah. So we just thought we'd get them and yeah, we need to be off really. We need to change that clock because it needs to go back an hour. Yeah. But we need to get off because yeah. we need to go and get that stuff and then get there. Okay. Bye.
Hey, so we're about a couple of minutes away, hopefully, to the restaurant. Uh, it's in a really nice area, like just out in the countryside of... God, I don't know where we are, kind of Greater Mansion. Rochdale! Um, don't know if we mentioned the restaurant's called Nutters. Uh, which is the surname of the chef. Been on television, he's like a, he had his own TV show thing, but... Uh, we've been, I think, three times before. This will be our fourth time here, I think. We tend to go at Christmas, don't we? Yeah, we've been at Christmas before. We've been around our anniversary. Our first anniversary uh, meal was here. So it'll be nice. Um, this is the first time we've actually been just the two of us, though, because we usually go with family, so... The sun's cracking through the clouds, and... It's a very pretty area, so I'll try and film the actual restaurant when we drive up to it. So we're here. Yeah, we're here now, and there's the uh, restaurant up there. You just a big driveway to get in. We're early. Yeah, we're early. How, how early are we? I think we're going to be the only people in the. The only people in the car park, probably, apart from staff. There's a couple of people. But uh, yeah, looking forward to this. I'm not that hungry though, but hopefully by the time we, eat, I'll be okay. Uh, we're here. There it is again. Not us. So we're early, so we're just sat watching the little squirrel and we've seen like blue jays and are they called blue jays? I think so. Look at him, he's eating. It's some sort of jay anyway. Um, and some wood pigeons and oh there's one over there, there's a squirrel over there, squirrel! This is like a chili bread, and then there's a focaccia and a rosemary roll, but this is really tasty. Tasty. Now we're just gonna wait for our desserts. Right, let me try and cover it up. Anyway, yeah, we've just come out of Nutter's, the restaurant, and it was really, really nice, wasn't it? It was so lovely. It was really lovely. Yeah, it was getting really busy when we left, um, but it was gorgeous. Perfect table. That's the fourth time we've been there, and I think the table was the best that we've had. It was the nicest table, Because we yeah. sat right next to the window, seeing the, the, like, the gardens and... It was nice and quiet, the atmosphere there is always really nice, the staff are very attentive and it's just a high-end place which we don't experience unless we go there or it's a rare thing for us to go to a, like a fancy yeah. place. But it was nice, I enjoyed it a lot. We had, well you saw what we had and every course was really nice and we had filter coffee. You sure um, that, yeah? yeah, we had some water. Uh, we left ten pounds for the tip, and then we left. It was just, it was really good, wasn't it? It was a really nice meal. Yeah. It's like really good if you go on a Sunday, um, because 
it is very expensive during the week but on a Sunday they do like a set menu so you get three courses and then your coffee and yeah. it's, at the moment it's £28. Which for a place like that is really good because normally I think it's about 60 um, per person for like a two course set menu it can be quite expensive anyway and like the drinks really add up because there's really good wines and drinks and like that but we don't tend to drink alcohol so well i wouldn't anyway because i'm driving well yeah and we, we don't tend to anyway very often no so we had a couple of we had a couple of diet cokes and then we had the water that you get with a meal so and we're heading home now the sun's out it's really quite hot the sun even though the air's really cool so uh yeah so we'll see you when we get home It's much later on, it's like, what time is it, like 1 o'clock, something like that maybe? Half 12? Yeah, 12 It's half 12, um, yeah, we got back from having the meal and we had a bit of a nap just because we're staying up to watch Evolution, which is the WWE All Women's Pay-Per-View, that's on at the moment. It's been alright so far, and they've made a few things that I'm not overly, well, not, not like annoyed at, but you know that I wouldn't have done um, but yeah it's been alright so far it's been it's been cool um, so yeah we're just watching that we're eating some of these little snacky things and these are cheese and onion chickpeas they're very nice um, yeah but we're just going to continue to watch this and we'll probably do a little wrap up after we've watched it but yeah I'll just show you a little bit of what's on at the moment if I can zoom in on it so it's the uh, Riot Squad versus Natalia, Sasha and Bailey at the moment. So, yeah, we're just going to watch this, aren't we, dear? Yeah, so it's cold as well, so that's why we're snuggled up in blankets. So, yeah, we're just going to continue to watch this.